Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle have reportedly been in the middle of a long drawn out feud but unearthed reports of their first meeting in 2017 suggested the two had instead immediately clicked and bonded. The Duchess of Sussex and the Duchess of Cambridge warmly embraced at the Commonwealth Day service this week. The pair, who were with their husbands Prince William and Prince Harry, wore big smiles and were quick to greet one another. Body language expert Judy James suggested that their rift might have come to an end, as the two were all about signaling friendship. She said, it was clear Kate and Meghan were keen to signal bonds of warm friendship today, rather than either distant or over-congruent displays from the last couple of outings. Ms. James added that Meghan seemed to be the one trying to reignite that spark while Kate made more active moves toward her sister-in-law. This marks a huge change as their behavior during the 50th anniversary of the investiture of Prince Charles at Buckingham Palace on March 5 was described by Ms. James as distant. The rumors that the royal in-laws were feuding started when, in November 2018, it was announced the Duke and Duchess of Sussex were moving out of Kensington Palace. Shortly after the announcement, Royal correspondent Camilla Tomindy also claimed she was told by two sources that Kate was left in tears by Meghan following a bridesmaid's dress fitting for Princess Charlotte before the Duchess of Sussex's royal wedding in May. As the feud rumors appear to have diffused, 2017 reports from Meghan and Kate's first meeting cast more light on their relationship. In January 2017, Meghan Markle was reportedly introduced to Kate and Princess Charlotte for the first time. According to The Sun, the Duchess of Cambridge travelled from her Norfolk home to London for the meeting, which took place at Kensington Palace. Prince George reportedly had to stay behind for school but Charlotte, who at the time was 20 months old, joined her mother. A source told the publication that Kate was really looking forward to meeting the former actress and added that the meeting was very important to Prince Harry. The insider said, they, Kate and Harry, are very close and he really values her opinion on girlfriends. Obviously Harry's mother, Princess Diana, died when he was very young so Kate really fulfills that older sister, maternal role. It went really well. The source added that the Duchess of Sussex even gifted Kate with a leather-bound dream diary as a birthday present and got to spend some time with Charlotte too, who she just adored. When Meghan and Harry spoke to BBC for their first joint TV interview following their engagement announcement, the prince commented on the relationship between his future wife and the Duchess of Cambridge, saying, Catherine's been absolutely amazing. Meghan then interjected, she's been wonderful.